There's a reason why everybody knows Chuck Yeager's name. And that's because while everyone working on this, you know, we're invested in it. Nobody's invested like the pilots are. And, you know, someone like Geppetto, he, he's demonstrated the courage to go get in a brand new airplane and to do with it things that's never been done, that's never done before. And uh, Geppetto is an accomplished naval test pilot. He's a top gun adversary pilot. Um, and he's flown every flight of XB-1 since its second flight as our chief test pilot. So uh, it is uh, calm, cool, collected. But before XB-1 broke the sky barrier for the first time, he told me he was more nervous about the press conference than about the flight. Um, and uh, and so he's done now both supersonic sorties on XB-1. He's broken the sound barrier a total of six times. Um, and on that, that second supersonic sortie, uh, what we were going for is to capture what's called a Schlieren image, uh, which is this, this sort of sophisticated phot photography technique uh, that you can use to make the shockwaves actually visible. And so you can get these incredible pictures. But to do it, you have to be going supersonic in a patch of the sky, plus or minus 250 feet, at a point in time, plus or minus about a second and a half. And so it requires insanely precise flying. And uh, as of this recording, we haven't released the image yet. But what I can say is we got it. And uh, Geppetto, Geppetto nailed it. It's an incredibly precise flying in, an, in a brand new airplane at a speed it's never flown at before. 